let me let me ask the first question to rahul rahul uh, you have done an mba from mit and uh, the focus of your focus has always been people uh, and their wellness what's your why what's your calling mm that's such a, a nuanced question and a difficult one uh, it's one that i ask myself every day um well it it, it actually started with india um even though I, i grew up in the suburbs of new york city in new jersey um i spent every summer going back to india to visit family my cousins my grandparents were there and it was really kind of experiencing having one foot in each one of those worlds and india obviously has has grown substantially in the in the last couple decades but during those early 90s it was very different um from from my new jersey upbringing i remember getting off the plane in mumbai and and thinking to myself like wow this, this like did i just enter a war zone with that old airport and and in the chaos and everything and and i would walk around the streets of mumbai and pune and i would just see people all over the ground that that were in poverty and and there were lepers back then and and things like that and it it really shook me it shook me that that one single doctor couldn't necessarily help all these people this was more of a systemic issue this was more of a macro level issue and so when i was going to college i it was very important to me that i focus on systemic level change on something that can affect them very deeply and personally which was their health and so i i went to tufts uh, for my undergrad with a focus on community health as well as international development and so the the first part of my career was very much focused on on helping the physical nature of, of people in more marginalized communities and that's afterwards I joined the UN and and I I joined USAID and worked in Africa as well as parts of Latin America um now I have much more of an interest in people's mental health and mental wellness um just because I think my own personal interest in and and being in a lot of different pressure cookers like MIT and McKinsey where you have a lot of that daily pressure um it it it's a different type of challenge when when all your physical needs are being met um but you're still not optimizing for your own personal sense of happiness and so so that's really been my motivation there okay how how can we pe- make people not only when they're they're ailing with physical ailments but at the same time in their day to day as they're going through that grind especially during times of uncertainty like we're seeing right now how can we help them live more fulfilling more purposeful lives that's the great purpose to have rahul and and since uh, you have seen india so i'm sure a lot of a lot of these images a lot of your experiences have stuck with you and those really help you uh do what you're doing today uh great job thank you so much looking forward to speaking with you more in the session